Okay, good morning. Okay, you ready? Today is day number six. Right. It's been a good five days, huh? Yes, it has. Last night we had a great dinner. That was good. And tonight we're having a uh, lobster tail. Oh, that's great. And we have a special guest coming for dinner. Okay. I think you'll enjoy her company. Oh, okay. Very much. So now we'll go to the library and I'll drop you off. And I'm going to go run some errands. Okay. And then after I run my errands, we'll come back. We'll try to get a game of chess in. And then we'll watch the baseball game. Sounds good. Giants are playing today. Right. One o'clock. That's great. Okay, let's go. Okay. Well, I'm here outside the Santa Rosa Library. And I'm going to pick up my dad. My dad's inside. And he's picking out some books to read. And uh, we'll go in and see what, what his choices were. As long as I can remember, he's been going to the library and he usually comes home with five to ten different books of different topics about everything from loving relationships to winning strategies of chess. So we'll go see what dear old dad has picked out, okay? Okay, so I found him. He's uh, sitting up here waiting for me. See what book he's got. How you doing? Okay. What books did you get? Wait a minute. Oh, you got to get the hearing aid. Let's see. What does he got here? He's got. Uh, They're all good books. Life in space. It's not him. It's you. That sounds like a relationship book. The truth you may not want but need to hear. Never Fly Solo. And Clinton in Exile. Okay. So you ready? Did you get your stuff done? Yeah. Is this a good library? Yes, it is. Do you have a card? Yeah. Okay. Let's go. Okay, so here is uh, here's John and my dad. We're, uh, oh, there you are. We're gonna have some lunch. Are you hungry? Sure. We're gonna have some uh, Mexican food. I like Mexican food. Okay, let's go yeah. and eat. Right. This is my uh, friend John. Hi. Say hello, everybody. Hi. John, I'm doing a documentary on my dad's visit. Oh. John a, has his, uh, John's in the computer business like you are. And he's a pilot. You're a pilot? Yeah. Well, he can also, I he- have a, uh, I have a, a grandson that's also a pilot, John. And when I was in the service, I was 11th Airborne. I used to jump out of C4 Oh, no. I wouldn't want to jump out. He's got a sailboat, too. You got a sailboat? Yeah, a little. All right, let's go in and eat. All right. Okay, so Dad's got the, uh, what do you got there? You got the Burrito Supreme. Yeah. Looks, Looks good. good, doesn't it? Yeah. Okay, let's eat. You got burritos in. Okay, here we are, game three. I know. And you're down two to nothing. I know. How's your confidence? Probably not too good. Huh? Your confidence is probably not too good. Confidence is pretty good. It is. Even being down 2-0. If you lose today, it's going to be tough to come back. Okay, so we're about 20 minutes into this game, and uh, there's just been one piece taken off the board. So far, I took a uh, knight belonging to my dad, and uh, that was on a mistake that he made. So, uh, other than that, it's a really tight game. It's uh, looking good, pretty, pretty good. I got him on the ropes a little bit, but uh, even so, it could uh, easily go either way. Okay, so uh, that was a big one. another mistake. My dad just moved his queen into a position that enabled me to come down and take his queen with my queen. So you can see that uh, it's not looking good for uh, dad right now. I've got four of his pieces, a queen and two, two knights and uh, a pawn to his, uh, to his one bishop. So it's, uh, as I said, it's not looking good. It's not that he's not sharp. It's just that he's uh, not paying attention or making mistakes or not thinking before he moves. But uh, anyway, 
So it looks like he's about to go down three games to zero. Finish okay, yours. so we're calling it a uh, calling it a not not okay. a draw, but we got to pause here and get dinner going. And um, I pretty much got him on the ropes, so he's not giving up. He's brought his castle down, and he he put me in check, and uh, I got to figure that out, but should be able to figure it out, and we'll get on with the game uh, maybe tomorrow. Okay, so dinner's almost ready. Great. You're going to have lobster for the first time in your life. Right. Boy, that's good. I can't imagine you've never had lobster no, before. No, I've never had it. And it's I've been prepared to you by a beautiful oh. lady. Yeah, that's great. I mean, what more could a guy ask for? That's true. Right? Oh, that'd be great. Okay. So, come on in here, and there is the lovely Chris Swanson. <laughs> Say hello, Chris. Hello. And uh, here is my dad's lobster tails. And what else do we have on the menu? We're making some crab, crab cakes. cakes, and we have some butternut squash and pear soup. And we have some lovely Hasselback tomatoes that are waiting. And we have some, oh, lovely, lovely vegetables all prepared. And the Russian lady neighbor next door brought us over some nice salad, pomegranate salad so we'll try some of that tonight as well alrighty so dinner's almost ready have the crab cakes ready yep ooh those look good now how come you're not having one Chris cuz I had crab last night oh you had crab last night okay like like big crab crab legs or the whole crab or <laughs> hmm no no okay <laughs> <laughs> sit at the head of the table which is Right there. Okay. <laughs> so we have a, uh, oh, we forgot to light the candles for dinner. So this is a, uh, I like this, Chris. These are nice. Thanks. What kind of flowers are they? Sunflowers. Sunflowers? Is that <laughs> what they are? Oh, okay. This is a butternut squash soup. Oh, okay. So we're going to have this as a little, this is the first course. Okay. <laughs> okay, and then we'll have the lobster. Great. Okay, so enjoy your first lobster dinner. I sure will. It looks really good, doesn't yes, it? Yes, it does. It looks very good. Very good. Uh-huh. Yeah. Look at that. And Can you I got a nice a potato there. Take a bite? Yeah, you got to work it out of there. Okay. Put the table for you. Okay. 